what about what about for you? What will his legacy be? Do you think to the sport? You know, yeah. how much will he be missed? He will be missed because he's a character and uh, he's, he's a, a personality and um, the, there's, there's so much history of the sport around his time with Ferrari and Alonso and of course the accident. So he, he's very much got a very good profile among fans. Um, at his best, a terrific driver and he will be remembered for that obviously that 2008 near miss. Um, I don't think, uh, much as he would disagree, I don't think he's ever been quite the driver again since his accident. Mm. He, he, in, in patches, but not consistently over mm. a season. Um, and I think Williams really needed to, um, g given that they've got uh, a rookie in Lance, uh, you know, still learning his craft in the other car, um, I think they really needed to step up and felt that um, Philip had plateaued and they needed some, something more. So who is that something more? Well, obviously, the, 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 the speculation is surrounding uh, Robert Kubica, um, which, uh, who will be testing the car on Tuesday, Abu Dhabi, I believe. Uh, Williams are reiterating there's no deal being done yet for next year. Um, what percentage chance would you give it? Of, of him being in the car? Yeah. Uh, about 98%. <laughs> really? Yes. As much as that? Yes. Well, that's fantastic. I would say so. Um, there's, so you obviously there's, know something that we don't. Um, uh, well, the, I think the, 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 there are, are pieces of information which it's you know you can put put stuff together. Because um, you're like that, you're um, a little private detective in the paddock you are. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I think you'll be in the car. I think uh, it's just about contracts and how the payments are structured because if you. Th um, it, he obviously was injured out of his mm. career and mm. um, the, the, there will be all sorts of insurance payments have to be paid back course, and stuff like yes. that so all of that has to be sorted out before yeah, you can do it very perfect. true and any concerns over some circuits um, being too tough for him or uh, will he be subbed in and out of those circuits I don't, I don't think would, that would be the plan um, I think the you know the, the various tests he's done suggest that he's physically able to to do it um, but it still obviously has to be a question mark, you know, because mm. until you see it for real on a race weekend, obviously that still poses a question mark. Um, I guess the insurance policy would be potentially, if that is the outcome, having Paul Deresta as your yeah. third driver again, we know what he can do at short notice. If, if the situation yeah. comes up, he's a ready made you know, infill, isn't he? If that's, no, there's no if doubt that Paul can step out. in and, um, you know, a great friend of Sky, so we love to see him involved, but it certainly gives me goosebumps to think Robert Kubitz is going to be driving in the car next year, so... I can already see Mark's book about it in, there you uh, go. in the coming years. Absolutely. <laughs>